Hey guys, what's up? It's Sly Cooper Rocks. Welcome to Let's Play Japanese Sly 2 Band of Thieves Part 20. In Part 19, we didn't do too much. We did one mission. However, we did begin an episode and we did learn a lot. So, we did Blimp HQ Recon and we began Episode 8, Anatomy for a Disaster. We learned a little bit about Arpeggio and what he's about. He's a flightless bird, he can't fly, he's angry about it. Um, and he envied uh, Clockwork's design and, you know, the fact that the parts were just, you know, not being used for their general purpose, uh, or their original purpose, I'm sorry. And, yeah. So a lot happened in Part 19. We found out that Nilo was leading us on the whole freaking time, uh, even through the missions that she was leading us through. So we were basically being led on the entire time by Arpeggio through Nila, and but we also found out that Nila had a plan of her own to overthrow Arpeggio, and so yeah, Arpeggio's original plan was to enter Clockwork's mainframe and be able to take over the world, and you know. Basically, the whole Claw Gang was his idea, his setup, his everything. And this blimp right now is on its way to Paris for a laser light show of hate. Uh, like I said in part 19, uh, or explained in part 19, uh, Dimitri's Nightclub is, you know, was the network for the major enraged spice. And once we get to Paris, you know, Clockwork or Clockla has the light laser power to enrage everybody and, you know, eventually take over the world. So, yeah, we're gonna try to prevent that. And in doing so, we're going to be shutting down four, all four of the Blimp's engines. And that's what these next missions are going to ultimately lead up to. Or at least we're hoping. So, uh, anyway. Without further ado, part 20. So we're basically trying to, uh, defeat Clockla now. Arpeggio is no more. He, you know, was kind of short-lived to us. But, uh, anyway, let's start these missions and, uh, you know, destroy these engines and try to take down Carmelita in the process. So, anyway, before the, before recording, as I always do, I got 29 bottles and I know the locations of all of the treasures, so we're gonna go ahead and take care of those before we do any missions. So let's go ahead and start that. So anyway, and we're not gonna immediately get the vault. The vault is going to be whenever we do Murray Sly Tag Team. So uh, we'll be getting that eventually. Anyway, our first treasure is down here, close to the Charge TNT Run mission, which we're gonna be doing in a bit. And it's right over here, after we totally get caught and get lit on fire, as per usual. Oh great, he brought friends. I'm just gonna go and take care of you guys. Oh look! Typical. Alright, well. Oh come on, I hit the wrong button. There we go. Yep, we don't start a let's play without getting caught. That's, you know, always the way I like to start my Let's Plays. Um, and we're just about to get caught again. If we don't huddle. Okay. Anyway, this is the Golden Vase. And I need to plan my route here. Um, I can kind of see where I can go. Uh, but I'm going to wait on this guy real quick. Just to... Make sure I don't get cut again. I would appreciate that. Come on, buddy. Alright, I'm gonna go and take you out, actually. What's that? He had a shiny and I didn't do anything? Well, that's because I don't need any coins anymore. You know, guys, can I record a Let's Play? Like, can I... Please? Guys? Guys, we'll have the Super Bowl party later. Okay? Okay? Alright. Alright, cool. Alright, anyway, I think I know my route. We're gonna try it and see if I succeed here. Alright. Get this planned out very carefully. And by carefully, I mean 
not super planned out. But I saw it for like a split second. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna try that. So we're gonna try that. Let's see if this works. Man, I'm running into a lot of these flashlight guards. They're slowing me down here. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Come on, we got this. No, we got this. We got this. We totally have this. We totally have this. And what do you know? We totally have it. That was a rocky start, though, eh? All right, so... I'm not Canadian, I swear. Um, so we have uh, the golden vase. So now we're going to go and get the other two things, which are quite conveniently placed, I'll have to say. So for both of these, they're just at the rear sides of, um, of the blimp. So first one, we're going to go to the uh, rear engine room over here. And that's going to be the jeweled egg. So we're just going to go straight back here. And over here. And we run into another lovely flashlight guard. If you guys remember uh, my slide to English Let's Play, um, I got caught by this guy. I forgot his pattern, and I got caught by him a few times. Because you don't expect him to just turn around uh, the way he does, or at least I didn't, uh, for whatever reason. And, you know, if you get caught by this guy, there's another guy right, right there for you. So, yeah, not, 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 not fun. I don't know why I said not, like, five million times, but, you know. I'm really covering my bearings today. Really am. Hey, you want a piece of me? Or are you just gonna slip off the <laughs> edge? Do you care? Oh, he doesn't care anymore. Alright, cool. We'll just move on with our life. Okay. So. Jeweled egg. Conveniently up here. Now I kinda gotta plan my route here again. Can't seem to get up. Yeah. Oh, you know what? We can use our fancy new uh, gadget here okay so we got the jeweled egg now I need to plan what I'm gonna do pretty sure I kind of remember um, can I just fair pat no I can't so let's see all right give me a second I think I just go over here and then we can go up here and then just paraglide. I actually don't know what the time is on this, but um, hopefully it's a little longer than I think it is. And we'll just see how we do. All right. So let's get the jeweled egg. All right, down here, cool. Oh, we got a minute 20, so that's not too bad. That actually will help quite a bit. Wow, okay, was not expecting that, but we can do it. <laughs> That's not the way I wanted to do it. For some reason, I couldn't hit the guy, uh, but all right, we'll do it this way, I guess. Yes, getting caught seems to be a very, very common trend in this part, or ever, really. So. Oh, come on, Sly. What happened to your reflexes? Here we go. Alright, we're just gonna totally ignore you. Alright, so now we got the jeweled egg. So, now we're going to get the final item, or the final treasure of the game. And that's gonna be the golden headdress. And we're gonna go simile, similarly on top of the safe house here, except we're going to go the other way. You see the left fan? That's where we're going. What's actually interesting is both of these treasures uh, are very close to in, uh, both rear engine rooms. However, the golden headdress is a little bit... Uh, is in a different location. Uh, it's not near an engine room. 
Although it kind of is, I guess you could say. Close enough, at least. So I'm just gonna completely ignore that guy, and we're just gonna. Well, that. That's, uh, let's see. Yeah, it's over here, I believe. And there it is, lo and behold. Okay. Alright, so let's see how we do on this one. Ooh, minute 20. Uh, not bad. I really wish that guy wasn't there, because that would have helped a little bit. But we'll see how we can do this. We'll see if we can make it. Um, uh, getting a little worried here. Oh boy. Please don't hurt me. Uh, this might not go as well as I thought. We'll see. We'll see. Can we, can we do it? Can we make it? Can we... Wow. I didn't think we'd be able to do it. And we're doing it. Don't, just don't shoot me. You can hassle me all you want. Just don't shoot me. Please. Alright. Awesome. Alright. So we've got the golden headdress, the, um, golden vase, and the jeweled egg. So go us. We just got items that we don't really need at this point, but we have anyway. So, uh, alright. So we're going to do the first mission of the part, and that is going to be Charged TNT Run. And the main reason we're going to be going to do... Excuse me. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Um, the main reason we're going to be doing that one first is because I like it the least. Um, I get very paranoid with that mission, and it's very, very, well, let's just say, I don't know, I, I just, I, I gotta do it first, basically, because it's one of those missions where you have to do it all over if you screw up once, and yeah. Because normally, you know, whenever you're getting, like, keys or whatever, uh, if you die, or, you know, you lose the mission, or fail the mission, rather, uh, you get the keys that you already collected back. However, in this mission, uh, we have to start all over again. So, without further ado, one of my favorite, <laughs> favorite, uh, missions, Charge T TNT Run. So... Here we go. Charged TNT run. One of my favorites. Oh, yay. Alright, <laughs> let's see how far we get. エンジンルームのドアはロックされているです。中に入れないのなら、外から壊すのもやむを得ませんですね。どうやって壊すんだ、ベントレー。あんな大きなエンジン。ところがです。それが壊れるだけの爆弾が、この飛行艇にすでに
uh, playing the English version. So we'll see how how well I impress myself this time. However, I'm not gonna put too many bets on me at the moment. Forgive me if I don't comment too much uh, during this, but it's not gonna be fun. We gotta really watch it. So I'm gonna go ahead and wait for this guy to do his thing and just go his path here. It's just gonna turn around any second now. Maybe. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. So far, so good. Man, if I screw up with a naked barrel, this is gonna be... Oh, gosh, really? Come on. Come on, dude. Come on. No, you... Ah, uh, you're screwing me up. And he's... We're gonna have to wait on him again. Are you kidding me, dude? Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. Instead of being right there this time, we're gonna be over here. And hopefully not get caught in that guy's path, because he's the one that screwed us up. Thanks, buddy. Love you. Um, actually, you know, I could just go up here and sneak it, come back down. Yeah, that, that works. Alright, so our, the next one we're headed for is over there. So, fortunately, all of the jump pads have been changed to a different model that are a little bit softer as we go up. So, alright, now we have a chance to steal this staircase here. Now we're going to head over here. And... Okay. Now I've forgotten actually which uh, engine room we're destroying. So I don't know which one's actually closer to it. But I think we'll manage. Alright, let's see. Can I just all down here. I'm actually going to really watch those lights. I don't think those lights move, actually, do they? Okay, no, we've, but we've got a uh, flashlight guard here. Alright, come on. Come on, buddy. Alright. Just going to make a soft landing here. Hopefully not alert him. Alright, we're going to... Whoa! Whoop. Okay, then. They like to come in pairs. A lot. Please don't move me. Please don't move me. Thank you. Oh, jeez. I hate that. Alright, so we're just gonna sit right here and go over here and... Oi. Alright, so far so good. We, uh... We're doing good. <laughs> oh, gosh. Alright. Dos. Okay, so now let's make our way to this balloon over here. Doing a little bit better than I anticipated, but uh, I'm just gonna. Nope, I'm not gonna risk that at all. I'm just gonna chill right here. All right, and you, buddy, you're just gonna keep going around. So I'm gonna follow you, and hopefully you don't make any sudden movements like they tend to do at the wrong time. Alright, buddy. Come on. Come in. Alright. Cool. But yeah, as you can see, these, uh, jumpers, or whatever you want to call them, pistons, I don't know, have changed color, and they raise us instead of just forcing us up. And fortunately... There are no guards up here, thankfully. Thank you, Sucker Punch. Or, oh, except right there. Uh, they basically get a, get rid of all the small guards during this mission. I meant. <laughs> they, of course, yes, still have the big ones. So we have to make our way over that way. Hopefully this guy does not turn around abruptly. Which, actually, I think he does. So I'm going to wait on him to see. I think he turns around right around here. Either that or he keeps going. I can never remember. That's that's usually my downfall when I can't remember a guard's path. 
yeah, I think he just comes right back around. Hopefully he doesn't look in my barrel and notice anything. See, the biggest downfall is when you're actually in their path. If they move you, that's, that's what the issue is. It's not if they shine their light, it's if they accidentally move you and you're in their path. That's the problem. Okay, so I'm gonna get out of his path and... Oh, freaking crap. Wow. I cannot believe that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh wow, they actually... They actually do give it back to you. Holy crap, I didn't... Okay. I guess I remembered wrong, or maybe this version is different. I don't know. But they do give you a checkpoint. Holy crap. I, I don't know why I thought otherwise. Thank you, Sucker Punch. Holy crap. Thank you so much. Wow. I, I, I don't remember that happening normally, honestly. I really don't remember. <laughs> Alright, but... Jeez, man, I thought I was gonna have to do that all over again and have to re-record and... Eh. Gosh, man. So much just flooded out of me whenever I made that mistake. Holy crap. What a relief when I saw the barrel next to me. With two charges. Oh my gosh. Oh man. What a mess up. But yeah, I don't, I don't know if I'm just remembering wrong or if... Uh, if in the English version it just does not reset. I, I honestly can't remember. Maybe they changed it for this version. I'll have to, I'll have to check that, actually. Because I just I just remember failing this multiple times and uh, as a result having to redo it. So Maybe it's just bad memory on my part? I, I don't really know. So I'm just going to chill here and hopefully not fall off again. And... Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. That's it, right. Come on. Ignore the raccoon tail in the barrel. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. I was hypnotizing you. You gotta be kidding me. Wow, that is the first time I've had it to where I was not in his path, and he just destroyed it. Alright, so this part's going swimmingly. Very swimmingly. I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. <laughs> oh gosh, man. See, I told you I'm terrible at this mission. And apparently these guards are very intelligent today. I don't understand it. But they are. They're usually not this intelligent. Usually not. I'm gonna see if I can beat this guy here. Awesome. Alright. Man! Well, I guess I should not take up a job in hypnosis anytime soon. That, that, that's a lesson for me. So you know what? We're gonna move out of your general path this time. And, you know, hopefully you don't be unusually intelligent this time. Are you coming down this way? No, you're not. Okay. Okay. All right, buddy. I swear, if I freaking fail this one more time, holy crap. All right. So... I'm just gonna see if I can just follow him up until his turnaround point here. Alright. Okay. So far so good. That's probably what I originally should have done is just followed him. 
All right, now we got another guy to worry about. Oh joy. Um, yeah, this is fun. Um, please don't. Ugh, these guards, why do you do this to me? Why do you do this? All right, I'm just gonna chill over here, so hopefully they he doesn't totally screw me up again. Come on, buddy. There's no raccoon inside the barrel. All right, yes. Cool. Oh, it looks like I did do it in the right order, I think. Yeah, uh, nope. We're just gonna, we're just gonna chill over here, sir. We're gonna chill over here. Nothing unusual over here. Nothing at all. All right, just keep going. Oh. Keep going. We're just gonna go around here. <laughs> just gonna go around here. We'll, we'll be good. We'll be fine. No, we won't. All right, we're just gonna be those mech barrels. We'll just be, be a mech barrel. There, there are no, there's totally supposed to be a mech barrel here. I'm the mech barrel. All right. Awesome. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. All right. Please, just can we keep it moving so I can stop overly smiling right now, hoping that I uh, make this. Can we? Okay. All right. So far. So far. Oh wait, we're going the wrong way. We have to go all the way up. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, we get to go all the way over there. Um. Oh. I hate you. I hate you. Okay, now we get to follow this guy. Hopefully he's not massively intelligent. Oh great, we get two of them this time. So, right. Wonderful. Yeah, this is mainly why I wanted to do this mission first. It's not one of my favorites. There, There's not a raccoon in the barrel. There is not a raccoon in the barrel. No raccoon in... What was that about? Where did that come from? Why did I just get random coins? Oh yeah, why doesn't everybody just join the party here? There's no raccoon in the barrel. None at all. All right. No raccoon in the barrel. Just keep remembering that you're looking forward to your lunch break. There is no raccoon barrel following you. I don't know why I'm trying to sound like a ghost rather than a hypnotist. Ooh. Okay. There's no raccoon in the barrel. There's no raccoon in the barrel. No raccoon in the barrel. None in the barrel. There is nothing in the barrel. There are simply three charges on a random TNT barrel. You're looking forward to the lunch break. Thank you. Okay, cool. All right. Oh my gosh. I think this is the worst I've had it with this mission. Not even kidding. Like, th ugh. Come on. See, I really hope the dual missions aren't this bad as far as time. Because honestly, it's already 30 minutes. Like, already almost 30 minutes. Ugh. So, I'm gonna go a little overtime this time instead of just doing one mission. Um, because I really think that the next mission isn't going to be as irritating and it's gonna be a little bit shorter. However, we'll see. But, ugh, hate this guy. I'm just gonna be super careful now. And, because I really have no desire to do this again. Alright, are you gonna go across again, or are you actually, okay. Alright, cool. However, he will return, ladies and gentlemen. He will return. Like... Right about 
now. There is no raccoon in the barrel. None. No raccoon here. Yeah, see, that's the turn that I hate so much. There's no raccoon in the barrel. No raccoon in the barrel. None. Just, just do, just go about your business. Go after, uh, okay. All right. All right, I think we did it. It only took us forever, but we did it. Oh my gosh. I think that's the longest it has taken me to do one mission. <laughs> Holy crap. Well, anyway, that's down one mission, or sorry, one engine. So, Clockla should be down 25% power. So, she's now got 75% power, because I can maths. Totally. I'm also not, uh, I'm also not British either. I just know they call it maths, which is interesting. Um, alright, so we're gonna head uh, back to the safe house and grab Murray for Murray Sly Tag Team. And, uh, because that's where the vault is. So, you know, obviously we're gonna do that one next. So, yeah, I am gonna go overtime a little bit. Simply because I don't want to be stuck with just doing one mission again. The only reason I decided to do uh, one mission last part is just because we learned a lot and there was a lot of cutscenes and there just wasn't anything I could do about it. Um, however, this time we don't really get that much story. So I just want to go ahead and do another one, you know, at the expense of going overtime. You know, it's not that big of a deal. So I will go over, over, uh, I will go over time just a little bit for one more mission. So, what are you doing near my safe house, buddy? Excuse you. Alright. So now we got Murray. And this guy's totally unsuspecting he's gonna get a sucker punch in the face. Heh. <laughs> sucker punch. Sorry. Alright. So anyway, we're gonna do Murray Sly Tag Team. And we're gonna get the vault while we're at it. Hopefully I don't go into the mission. There we go. I was afraid I would. Alright, Murray Sly Tag Team. Or whatever that's supposed to say. I know what it's supposed to say, but I don't know what that actually says. But, alright, Murray Sly Tag Team. Mare, <laughs> Alright, so this is a duplicate, uh, well, almost duplicate, of Silence the Alarms in Episode 1, where we had to destroy the alarm horns around Dimitri's area. So, it's kind of funny that we're doing this uh, so late in the game. We're doing this on the opposite opposite side of the game this time. So, all right. This guy looks like a good specimen to start out with. You know, since they caused me the most the most trouble last time. All right, so that's one. At least I think I damaged it. Oh gosh, there's five of them. Instead of yep, that's the big difference. Instead of five, there's three. I mean, instead of three, there's five. I'm going insane. In case you. Haven't already figured out. Oh! Oh, well, that's great. Thanks, guard. Thanks. I appreciate it. I don't even know if I'm like. Oh, you know what? Screw it. Why am I going after guards and not just these barrels here? I don't even know if I was damaging that. Come on, destroy it, destroy it. Alright. Run away! Run away. We are gonna run away. Running. We're just getting our exercise. No problem. No problem. Alright. That is what's convenient about those, uh... Those mech egg spawn points is that you can just infinitely... Throw mech eggs at it. I don't think there's one near here, actually, though. Actually, there might be. I think there's one... 
Yes. Awesome. So instead of just going after guards, we can just hit him like this. Nothing to see here, folks. What is with you guys and pushing me off the freaking thing? Yep. I think that's a trend for today. Getting kicked off the blimp, literally. Okay, alright, alright. Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Yeah, I guess we're good. Alright. Alright, where's the next one? Oh, conveniently over here, so all we have to do is just... Alright, not too bad. Really, once we get the field work done, it won't be that much of a problem. Oh, look, it's the triplets. They've come for... to hang out? I don't know. Honestly, I just want to get this mission over and done with. <laughs> Mainly because I, I, I'm really on my toes because of the uh, first mission. Because, oh, jeez. That, that seriously has got to be the mission I hate the most now. Because a lot of the missions that I used to really have a problem with, I've gotten slightly better. That one, uh, I don't really think I've gotten better at it at all. Oh look, I'm being double teamed again. Yeah. Oh great, thanks for the not health. Appreciate it. I'm gonna die. Oh! Oh, oh, well that's great. Just my luck. There actually was health. Except... I didn't see it. And of course it goes away right as I need it. So, thanks! Okay, so this is broken. So we're gonna have to... Improvise. I actually don't think that damaged that. Try it again. Um... Again, I don't think we... Are you serious? Are you sick? Well, there we go. I officially need health. Yeah, this part is going great. Isn't it? Ugh. Alright. Let's see if I can get at least one more health. I don't want to die. You know, I don't think I've hit that at all, actually. No, I have not been hitting that at all. Now I have. Oh, look! It's my friends again! I swear, if you make me die... Okay, good. Awesome. Alright. Okay. Alright. Yeah, this part is not going as well as I had hoped, or anticipated, or whatever. Okay, hopefully we don't alert this guy by just tossing a barrel. Okay. Oh, that was the last one. Conveniently. Okay, so... Where are we going? All the way over there. Alright. And then we can, uh end this bad luck part that is part 20 which is kind of ironic because 20 is my favorite number now so it's kind of sad that this part is my unlucky part well actually you know I wouldn't say it's my worst part either come on buddy so I really should be enjoying this part because part 20 but Ugh. It's been, it's, been, it's been a very stressful part. Ironically. But hey, you know what? It's alright. It's alright. We're almost done. And... Part 20. I mean, part 20. A lot of you guys who don't know what I'm talking about are probably just like, What? Huh? I don't get it. Oh, wait a minute. We've got to get up there somehow. Uh, right. What am I missing here? I'm, I'm like blanking right now. Like, how do I get up there?
Oh, right. I have to go to the balloon things. Yeah. This, this, this part is just not my lucky part, unfortunately. Which is a shame. Because, again, 20 is my favorite number. Okay. Whoa. Well, wonderful. I'm going to die. I'm so... Well, just to add to my bad luck, thanks a lot. Jeez, man. Alright, where are we going to end up? Ugh. Man, now I just want this part to be done. So much. I'm just going to knock you out. And not be able to do anything with you? Okay, that's weird. Okay, I'm going the wrong way. Actually, you know what? I'm kind of not, because I do need to get on one of those balloons here. Ugh. Yep. Yep, it's time to get caught again. Bum, 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 bum. Welcome to The Price is Right, where it's time to get caught by guards. Oh, and you. Thanks, thanks. I needed that. I needed that electric stimulus. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> okay, all right. So all we had to do was just go over here, and it takes me 20 minutes to do that. All right, well. Let's, uh. Oh, yeah, I know what we have to do now. Yeah, slide, just go through the door handle. Nobody will notice. All right, this part where we just... Why is there a TV on the blimp? Do you really think you're going to get reception this high in the air? Like, seriously. Alright, so once we just get through this, we can end this part. Yeah, I can't believe my parts are supposed to be 30 minutes now, and it's going to be a lot longer. But hey, you get to get you get to see my stupidity. So lucky you, I guess. I don't know. I guess as long as you're enjoying yourself. You get to make fun of me as long as you want. I don't know. I don't know what I want. I just want this to be over. So I can stop screwing up. And... <laughs> uh. Alright, alright. We're, we're, we're almost... Wait. Are you serious? Wow. I screwed up. And there's that TV again. I just made a giant circle. Go figure. I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy flapping my mouth to notice that I completely passed everything that I live for. <laughs> okay, maybe I'm being a little melodramatic, but I, I, uh, want this to be over with. Please. I really don't know how I passed that. How did that... How did that happen? I don't understand. Alright, we're close. Alright, here we go. I don't know how I managed that. I, I really don't know how I managed that, so don't ask. Just don't ask. I mean, you can ask if you like, but I won't have an answer for you. Oh, great. Oh. Oh, well. Well, that was great.
Riveting. Oh, good. Thank you. I thought I was gonna... Oh. You know what? I'm not even gonna edit this part. I'm not even gonna edit it. Just... You guys get to see my bad luck firsthand this time. Ugh. I don't even know how I would edit it. I really don't. So yeah. Everything's going to be put intact. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy, you know, the big game uh, tomorrow. Me personally, I enjoy the commercials more than the actual game, but hey, you know. Alright, so now we got our vault here, finally. You know, it only took forever. So, this is our last vault of the game. So, here we go. Alright. So, two. What? Oh, seven, two. I didn't see the seven. Seven. Two. Five. And indeed, we got Shadow Power, and I kind of love how this chair was very artistically placed there, and Sly was just like, There's a chair in front of me? Oh, I need to jump over it. Oh, okay. So, destroy you, freaking chair. Also, I, I just noticed that Shadow Power was very, you know, opaque. Um, or not opaque. Very translucent, that's what I'm looking for. Um, I don't actually remember that uh, in the English version. And maybe it's just been forever since I've gotten Shadow Power. Uh, but that might be an added touch that they added. I don't know. Anyway, let's finish off this part so I can just stop whining. <laughs> As Sly just goes through a lever like it's nothing. You know, no, uh... Nothing unusual here. Alright, guys, anyway... <laughs> I'm gonna close off this part once and for all. This is... Oh, man. I, I I thoroughly hope you enjoyed my stupidity during this part. Anyway, guys. I've been Sly Cooper Rocks. I hope you enjoyed Let's Play Sly, uh, Japanese Sly 2 Band of Thieves Part 20. I've been Sly Cooper Rocks. Don't forget to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to like and follow our Facebook and Twitter pages. Don't forget to follow my personal Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other two channels, Sly Cooper Rocks and Sora Rocks. All those links will be down in the description. And I will see you guys in part 21. It's really a shame that this was my bad luck part because, again, 20 is my favorite m number. But, you know, we did it. We got through it. And you guys got a little bit of an extension on this part or whatever. Anyway, I, th I hope you thoroughly enjoy this part, <laughs> and I will see you guys in a hopefully slightly less mistake build part 21. I once again have been Sly Cooper Rocks, and I will see you guys next time. Bro Hoof, and see you guys.